in this experiment to determine the width of groove in the compact disc using laser the apparatus required a compact disc laser source and screen scale etc the cd the data is stored in tracks and sector which consists of bits and lines the digital informations are stored in the cd in the form of closely spaced rows and these rows act like a reflecting diffraction grating further if the label in the cd is removed then the cd will act as a transmission grating the distance between the one pit land to another is termed as a width of groove in the cd let us find the width of groove of the cd take a empty compact disc first we need to remove the label surface from the cd for this fix a packing tape on a label surface and peel off the tape so that the label surface will come along with the tape now the cd will, will look like a transparent material this cd will now act as a transmission grating fix the transparent cd in the stand using the clip in each way that the reflecting side should face the laser source here this is producing for central maxima and principal maxima for example the distance 5 cm screen and cd then you measure the distance between the central maxima and the first order spectrum on both left and right side of the central maxima the distance noted next move 10 cm the distance between cd and screen measure the distance between central maxima and the first order spectrum on both side left right side of the central maxima distance noted Next move 15 centimeters. The distance between for principal maxima to central maxima left side diffraction distance noted. Then principal maxima to central maxima right side distance noted. Next move for 20 centimeters. Then left side diffraction distance and right side diffraction distance noted here with is producing for single diffraction next move 25 centimeters the same procedure the left side diffraction distance and the right side diffraction distance noted here it's produced for single diffraction so auto spectrum is value is 1 now the substituting diffraction angle theta and wavelength lambda of the laser source in the given formula we can find the width of groove in a compact disc